If someone says help, you just, your instinct, you don't even think about it. Exclusive tonight at 10, a Home Depot shopper hears cries for help, then takes matters into his own hands to stop an accused shoplifter. But he wasn't prepared for what happened to him next. Here's 41 Action News reporter Andres Gutierrez. Almost two weeks later, the Good Samaritan who tried to stop a thief at this Home Depot at 96 in Metcalf is still recovering from his injuries. He jumped into action when he heard the screams for help. And my instinct told me I need to get involved. A trip to Home Depot left Jackson Lou with a swollen face and blurry vision. I could not see anything. It was completely red. On May 9th, he had just checked out when this woman rushed past Lou, a former police officer. So I saw that, so I gave it a chase. And then to about over here, I made a contact with the uh, loss prevention guy and I asked him the situation. So he told me, you know, she still stop her, stop her. Lou caught up with the woman and his training kicked in. I wrapped my arm around her neck, kind of like a brace. I didn't squeeze or I didn't do anything, so I did like this. And then I took her on the ground. I held her hands basically like this um, the entire time. So I, I tried to talk to her. I was like, hey, hey, tell me what's going on. During the exchange, Overland Park police say the driver of this gold Honda Accord got out and kicked loose several times before driving off with a woman. Within minutes of posting her photo on social media, police identified her. They say she stole more than $400 worth of tools and electronics. Detectives are now working to arrest her and Lou's attacker. The department commends Lou's actions. Once you're a law enforcement officer, you're always a law enforcement officer. You can't get that out of your system. For those who may be in a similar situation but don't have Lou's experience. I would want the citizen to be a trained observer. In other words, get the license tag number, get the make and model of the vehicle, call 911 and, and let us know the direction of travel. Lou says he may think twice before stopping another shoplifting suspect unless someone is in immediate danger. If someone says help, you just, your instinct, you don't even think about it. You just go out there and help the people they need. In Overland Park, Andres Gutierrez, 41 Action News.